The following is a presentation of TFNN. Live at TFNN, the Bull Bear Binary Option Hour. Brought to you by Nadex. Call now, toll free at 1-877-927-6648. Internationally at 727-445-1044. Now, Tom O'Brien and Daryl Martin. Welcome, folks. Uh, Tom O'Brien, I appreciate you growling and prowling out here with us. We get the uh, Dow Industrials right now uh, up 32 and down 32. NASDAQ is up 10. S&Ps are up three, uh, off three and a half. We have the gold contract down six dollars and thirty cents, trading at one thousand two ninety four. Silver's down uh, three pennies at eighteen dollars and thirty two cents. Platinum's off ten at twelve seventy five. You get uh, copper down seven pennies at two fifty. Oil down to forty four cents at forty five eighty eight. Oil wants to break through that bottom, folks. And bonds, the ever ready bond market, folks, just can't hold it down. Not even close either. Um, yesterday, you know, it definitely came down. Yesterday had an expansion of volume that came down, but it was going into a much higher volume bar. So bottom line, what do we have out here today? Snaps right back. You get the ten year up uh, fourteen ticks at one twenty nine. 18, the 30 years up a full point and eight ticks at 149.25. Both of those want higher price. King dollar, King dollar is up by 638 ticks at 95.01. King dollar had a wide price spread yesterday. Didn't have the juice behind the move. Got up to another 950 ticks out here today. And what's interesting about King dollar is that King dollar has done a 1 to 1.618 move on the top side on the daily, which is a very an immediate change of trend. That's on the daily. On the monthlies, uh, what has happened is that it's a, it's a full extension. It's actually more than a full extension. So we'll see where that uh, shakes and bakes. The euro. Euro is down uh, 116 at 112.49, and the yen is uh, down 78, trading at 117.72. Our phone number is 877-927-6648. Give us a call, folks. Want to know what's going on in your world. And in the world of the Nadex uh, platform, folks, come over to our website at TFNN. And you're going to see the banner on the top, on the side. Hit that banner. You can bring up the account. They'll put $25,000 worth of paper money into your account. Uh, and you'll start to understand how these contracts move. You've heard the promotion many times that your trade is your stop. In this type of market, folks, it's absolutely not only uh, great, it's dynamic in a huge way. Why? Because the fluctuations are absolutely huge. Yesterday, what was that yesterday? Bottom line, yesterday, you get a bear market move, a counter trend move. That's a typical bear market move. Uh, what, what, you, you, what you're seeing out here today, let me tell you something. Uh, as, this, as this day wears on, uh, there's going to be a little shocker out here. The reason that you have a shocker is what? Is that markets across the world um, were up, are up. If we go over to Asia last night, Asia was up across the board. Europe this morning, uh, up big time too. You, the DAX up almost 2%. The cat's up 1.7. Bottom line, our markets can't handle it. Um, and what I suspect you're going to see here as the day wears on, you're going to see a bit more selling uh, as we come in. Because what we have had is this. You had an expansion of volume in the daily. Uh, what you didn't have, however, and if we uh, turn around, I'll put this S&P up so you can see how this thing is shaking out here. Uh, what we didn't have is that as to what it's going into. Uh, it's uh, not an ABC structure on the way down because we did more than a 0.618 retracement from the high out here, if we use the SPY, from the high of that 208 uh, coming down into this uh, 198. Uh, but what we do have is that uh, bottom line, how we had come down, not only uh, on the January uh, 12th area, the weeklies, okay, going from the Jan January, the week of January 3rd, the week of January 12th, Bottom line, you get much higher volume. This baby is still building cars to get into lower price. So it's going to be wild watching this uh, whole baby shake out, particularly today, because what, what ends up happening is this, folks. It's really hard to basically get a negative market when we've had a positive week, you know, coming into a Friday. Uh, with the divergence that in Europe, okay, you have a monster uh, uptrend that is out there, no doubt. Let's go over and we take a look at this uh, gold market. Gold market right now is down $9.30. You get uh, 90,000 contracts traded 
and how, and of course, uh, coming into a Friday in the gold market, we look at this, jeez. Gold and silver folks want much higher price. So uh, this is gonna be a nice opportunity that we start looking at this and say, okay, uh, how is this baby trading out? Right now, this 10 minute bar, you get an expansion of volume, no doubt, but what you're coming into, you're coming into contracts of 13,500 right now. That's the contract value that we're coming into when we go take a look at how we went topside at uh, 840 yesterday morning. Uh, thus far on the 10 minute bar, we're two minutes into it, so there's an expansion of volume there, but it's gonna need a lot more because thus far you only get uh, 3,200 2, 3, contracts. So we're talking uh, big numbers here. I take this and I'll put this on a 10 minute bar. Oh, there she is. Okay, so. On a 10 minute bar, let's see, why isn't this? Oh, I see what's going on. Okay, let me get the volume in here. Insert study. I knew I had, didn't have something. There we go. Okay. So what we're looking at is this. Um, this expansion down, uh, the, the first expansion that, uh, first expansion we had at 04 o'clock this morning, that was light volume in an extraordinary way. Uh, this here, what you're gonna set up, oh, this is gonna be interesting, okay. So the setup here goes like this. We're 1289.70. The setup, folks, is 1286. So we'll see where this uh, baby shakes out at 1286. And where 1286 is, this is what you have happening. Here she is right here. The 1286 area, you let it get down to that first. The 1286 area is where we went topside uh, on at 8.40 yesterday morning. And, and you're gonna see uh, how this baby shakes out. We'll see whether that number one, can it hold? And number two, uh, what the correlation is inside of that. You get lighter volume coming into that area, baby. Um, that, and if we go over to the Nadex platform for a second, and we take a look at this, let me close this one out. Uh, if you haven't traded the Nadex platform yet, folks, this is not only a great time to do it, but what you wanna wrap your head around a bit uh, are the correlations inside those currencies also. Because what we're gonna have and we're gonna continue to have uh, is wide price spread, accelerated volume uh, in all these currencies. Whether you're a bull or a bear inside these currencies, you wanna wrap your head around it. If we go over to the commodities for a second inside the Nadex platform, we take a look at gold. Gold right now is down 13 bucks at 1287.70. So we're looking for that 1286. And if we take a look at some of the, let's see, so 1014. First off, uh, 1014. So we got 9 to 11. Let's see what we got. We got 10 to 12 out here. And what we're looking for is that we'd be looking for, I'm looking for a spread in the closest bottom of the box, what I'm looking for. There's one right there. So it's 1285. 1285 is not bad. Okay. So this gives us, oh, that's only the noon. Okay. Let's see what this one says. This one's a noon. That would be a $43 risk for a $107 profit if that's the case. Let's go all the way out to 130 and see if we can get close to the bottom of that box. So 1286, that's where we're at right now. Now we got to make sure that that's 1280. And that one there would be 83. That's not, that's, that doesn't work either. Okay, so let me see the daily. What we're looking for specifically is I'm looking for a 1280 box basically. 1285. Okay, that one's not there. 9 to 11. There's the 1285 right there. Okay, so this is going to get interesting. Okay, so 12. One there. Okay, that's not a bad one. Yeah, that's a good one, actually. Okay, so the, the box we'll be looking at, folks, is this. If you have over the Nadex platform, what it'll be is this. It's a 1285 to 1300 box. The, you could buy one, uh, you get a risk of $25, you get a, a gain of $125. Um, the, and you're only looking for a $15 move. Okay, so what do you do with that? Okay, so what we do is this. You turn around, we go back over to the gold contract now, and what you're gonna be looking for is that we're gonna be looking for a rejection of price. In fact, you can sell the S&Ps right here too, folks. Okay, the S&Ps, this is gonna be an absolute shocker out here today. This is gonna be wild watching this whole thing shake out. So 
Okay. Let's go over the S&Ps, because what you have here is this. We got an expansion of volume down there, and that thing's not ready yet. That would mean that you have to test the lows of the, 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 the bar right now. Because in gold, if you're watching Tiger TV, what we've done thus far is this. It's still light of volume, but we got, we got 10,000 contracts, and it looks like it could do the 13,000, coming into 13,000. So we'll see. It hasn't got to the swing point, which is pretty wild. Let's go over to the S&Ps. We take a look at the S&Ps and see if that's where we want to be. The, uh, okay, so we're down five bucks. Yep, that's where we want to be. Okay, so check this out. So you're, you got at the highs, and what we have on the S&Ps is this. The S&Ps have the high volume swing low out here from yesterday at 2019 okay so if we go back over to the 8x platform for a second let's go over there and i'm gonna get you're gonna get it i'm gonna get into the indices into the spreads i'm gonna go to the us 500 and we're at 1017 right now so if we go out to noon first that's that's that there's not one at noon because now what I'm looking for, oh no, hold it one second, 2050 I'm looking for. 2050 at the top of that box, oh, there's one right there. That's, a, that's not bad. Okay, so if we're selling one at noon, that's not a bad one right there. Okay, so check this out. Um, you take the noon, so this gives you uh, an hour and 45 minutes. Uh, the noon 2040 to 2050 area, you'd be selling the 2050 area. You would... Uh, you would get for that right now 2047. Okay, so you'd be, you'd be giving up uh, a few points. Um, bottom line is that that is a number that uh, can be done. Uh, you're giving up $22 for 78. And what you'd be looking for within uh, the two hour time span is that you'd be looking for number one, the next acceleration on the way down. And where, where I suspect you have, and this is where it's always important to make sure you have your price objective. And the price objective out here is this. The price objective would be the low of yesterday. That's the first one. Now, let's go look at one for daily because certainly in an hour and a half, that's not going to happen. What, you would ha what, would, what could very well happen, though, is that we'll, get the, we'll go down 10 points, which is the 2041 within that. That would still give you plenty of bread inside that contract. Uh, if we close this one for a second and we go into the daily, let me just see the daily, 2050. Now you get a 60 of the daily. At the 415, you get a 60 also. What, you, what you're trying to do, folks, is this, is that you, you're trying to get uh, at the top of the box if you're selling, at the bottom of the box if you're buying. Well, it's going to be interesting with gold here. The dollar's going to give it up. Sell the dollar. That's the bottom line. It's a beautiful thing. It's pretty wild, man. And oh, listen to this. This is a this is a this is the best view there is. Jack Wu this morning was on CNBC. It's the first time that I heard Treasury Secretary since Snow saying a strong dollar is great for America. You know what happened the last time, folks? Dollar went from 121 to 70. Oh yeah. You stay right there. We're coming right back. Down on 56. We're told to follow our passion and everything else will fall into place. I hope that's what each of you are doing each and every day. Hi, I'm Steve Rhodes, host of the Money Master Show at TFN.com, and my passion for technical analysis is what led me to the most fundamental discovery and pattern recognition, the Rhodes Momentum Indicator, market scanner and trading strategy, a set of tools that identify the momentum and power of the trend, the likes of which have never been seen before for every market and every time frame. Yes, folks, the trend is your friend, unless you're on the other side. New to technical analysis? This is the place to start. And experienced traders, take advantage of the trend like never before. Experience the power of the Rhodes Momentum Indicator each day, available to subscribers of my newsletter service, Mastering Probability. I guarantee your satisfaction for the next 30 days unconditionally, so there's no risk to you other than being on the wrong side of the trend. Mastering Probability, available on the homepage of TFNN.com. And folks, Live with passion. Platinum, grains, crude oil, gold, copper, cattle, hogs, gasoline, natural gas, coffee, cotton, cocoa, and sugar. These are just some of the commodities mentioned in the most recent issue of Andy Hecht's Techno Mental Commodity Report.
and he publishes his weekly newsletter every Thursday morning where he breaks down the commodity market and provides his subscribers with specific trading recommendations based on his trading methodology. By signing up for a free trial to the Technomental Commodity Report, you'll get a full 30 days to try out this powerful newsletter service and see for yourself the types of trades Andy has recommended for his subscribers. When you sign up for a 30-day free trial, you're under no obligation to pay anything. And should you decide to continue, you will lock in the low rate of only $79 a month. Sign up right now for the Technomental Commodity Report and make sure you're ready to catch the next big trade in commodities. For more information and to get started today, visit the front page of TFNN.com. You've always taken the long view when it comes to investing, but what if there's an opportunity right under your nose? What if you could be more responsive to market trends to seek to boost your portfolio performance right now while seeking to reduce your overall risk? At Direction Funds, we connect investors with alternative strategies that seek to maximize their returns. Smart investors deserve smart alternatives. Find yours at directionfunds.com. An investor should consider the investment objectives, risk charges, and expenses of Direction Funds carefully before investing. The prospectus and summary prospectus contain this and other information about Direction Funds. To obtain a prospectus or summary prospectus, please contact the Direction Funds at 800-851-0511. The prospectus or summary prospectus should be read carefully before investing. Investing in index funds may be more volatile than investing in broadly diversified funds. Distributed by Rafferty Capital Markets, LLC. You know what's cool? Taking something that's good for you. Something specifically formulated to help with weight loss, better sleep, stress reduction, and the need to detox. Nico, our hunter and gatherer ancestors found all their nutritional requirements for health in their wild environment. But today, our food sources no longer contain the vitamins, minerals, and nutrients our bodies need to stay healthy and strong. That's why we need Primal Edge Daily Nutrition. It includes a special blend of ionic, soil-based vitamins, minerals, fatty, and amino acids in an easy-to-use liquid form. Primal Edge is powered by highly concentrated fulvic and humic acids, nature's preferred delivery system. They have been called miracle molecules because, like sunlight, air, and water, life cannot exist without them. That's right, Paige. They ensure we receive all the nutrition we need to be healthy and thrive. We, we take, take it, it every, every morning. morning. Primal Edge, formulated and approved by Nico and Paige of Living a Primal Lifestyle. Buy it today for just $89. Click on the Primal Edge banner on the front page of TFNN.com. This segment is brought to you by TFNN. Test drive all the newsletters for free at TFNN.com. Welcome back, folks. Uh, Dow right now is uh, down 41. You get the NASDAQ uh, up three. Uh, S&Ps are off four. And as you come over to our website at TFNN, folks, you want to test drive this Nadex platform. It's a great platform uh, trading. Hit the, the Nadex banner. You can bring up the account. They'll put 25000 of funny money into your account. Uh, the, the first trade out here is the selling that... Uh, Noon at uh, 2050. Now, check this out. The euro, folks, okay, uh, my take right here is that this euro, you're going to see this is going to be really wild shaking this out. So we're at 1.126. Uh, this little baby's building cars right now to get into this 113 area. So we'll see where that uh, does shake out. Uh, but that in itself, okay, is going to be uh, pretty intriguing, you know, because the euro, of course, went straight down from this uh, 116 area. And it looks to me like we're building cars right now. It's, it's going to be really easy, by the way, to, to get up into that level. Uh, and where am I going with that? Where I'm going with that, if you go over to the uh, dollar index for a second, what you're going to see is this. The, the extension, uh, as I said right at the beginning of the program, is more than a 1 to 1 1.618. That sets up an immediate turn in the dollar. Now, what it sets up, which is really insane, okay, is a total change of trend. That's, that's how that sets up. <laughs> this morning... As we were just going to break, what I was talking about, Jack Lou was on CNBC, and it was so wild that that was the first time that I heard, if you remember, depending on how long you've been in the gold market, the market in general, uh, John Snow, 2002, 3, 4, 5, on a continual basis, the dollar is strong, uh, is, the dollar is great for America, okay? Bottom line, that's the first time I heard a Treasury Secretary say anything about the dollar, uh, and it, specifically it was, yes, 
The dollar is great for the United States of America, for America. It's like, oh, really? Okay. So as that is happening, what, what, are the, what's, what is the Treasury doing? What is the Fed doing? You know, we'll, we'll see. But the bottom line is that what you're going to see out here today, the dollar has just gone from 95.75, and right now you're at 94.90. And uh, the way that this is trading right now, I suspect what you're going to have here is that we had a spike higher. And this is typical at bottoms or tops. The last time that uh, this had any juice intraday out here was 93.40. You're at 94.19. And we'll see on the next expansion down because the spike up here this morning had zero in it. At uh, 710, you had 1,400 contracts. You came off that level. The first time you came off the level, you come off with 2,200 contracts. We just, we have a lower low right now. At the low of the day at 94.35, folks, has 2,900 contracts. So the way that's setting up, Guess what? That's setting up that you're going to go test the 94.49. You know, that's 500 uh, ticks down. We'll see uh, if, in fact, that happens. Because what, what you will have there, if, in fact, we have that, is that you're going to have a flat uh, dollar out here today after the expansion top side. Uh, and we'll see how gold reacts to this. If we go over to the gold market quickly and we take a look at that, that gold market into, into that move, thus far, gold hasn't done a thing, okay? Gold's down 12 bucks. You have 105,000 contracts. I just love how this thing is trading. It's blowing my mind, actually, okay? Because you gotta, you gotta wrap your head around this. The dollar, is it, this move has been beautiful, extraordinary move. What gold's doing, gold is building cars basically do a monster ABC up. The A point on this gold contract would be 1170. The B point up there is 1307. So it's a buck 30. If, if the C point is yesterday, you're talking about 1400 gold. And the way this is setting up right now, it, it looks to me like it's doing it. Gold hasn't even got to the lows of yesterday, yesterday. Uh, and guess what? Now it's not gonna make it. You know, you know gold just didn't do intraday out here, folks? Intraday, it couldn't take out its swing low from yesterday. And they gave it everything they had. Uh, you, they, and guess what? It's lighter volume. They gave it 12,800 contracts. It came into 13,500 contracts. Bottom line, you'll have to build a little cause here intraday. Okay, not to get to higher price because that is still an expansion with volume and they like to get tested and you have to build cause out of it. But if you don't get to a swing point at a high or low when it's pushing with volume, what happens is that, what is it showing? It's showing, in this particular case, they're not strong enough to knock it down. They're not strong enough to get, not get it under the swing point. And swing points are where the market talks, walks, and squawks. So the way this baby is set up at this particular point is it's saying, number one, you're going to build some cars to basically get right back top side. And if we look at this, in fact, let me go over, I'm going to go over to the GLD for a second, because see, you can, you can gleam a lot out of the GLD, too. Oh, check this out. This is, a, this is really cool. So the GLD, what do, you what do you have with the GLD? That's down a buck and a half. You get 2.4 million shares. 2.4 million, folks, going up to 17 million. This building an ABC structure on the way up. A to B equals C to D. You go up with volume, you pull back with lighter volume, you go up with volume. Dow Industrials right now are down 37. NASDAQ is up one, SPs are off four. You stay right there, folks. Come right back. Today, it's hard to tell if the economy is coming or going. Regardless, I want my money going in the direction I choose. If that's your stance as well, then you want to know how EverBank can help keep your money thriving just the way you want. Is growing your money a priority? EverBank is committed to a yield pledge promise to pay high yields on your checking, money market, and CD balances. Looking to diversify? EverBank ingeniously developed accessible ways to spread your money around the world into foreign currencies and even non-FDIC insured metals. And when it comes to your wealth, they bring a highly experienced and global perspective to help you manage it. EverBank's financial philosophy flies in the face of the status quo. They believe your money's performance should not be determined by today's economic circumstances, but by the drive to rise above them and create opportunities that favor your objectives. If that excites you like it does me, visit everbank.com slash TFNN to find out what they can do for you. Again, that's everbank.com slash TFNN. Visit them today. Everbank is a member FDIC and equal housing lender. 
How would you feel if you had a powerful decision-making tool that has the ability to find high-probability trading opportunities across multiple time frames in equities, currencies, and futures? Search no more. Take advantage of the best trade with the Taz Profile Scanner. Trade with confidence and clarity while using the software that thousands of institutional traders rely on to help them make the best and most accurate decisions. Scan over a 1,000 equities, currencies, and futures instruments for high-probability trading setups utilizing the Taz architecture. As seen on Bloomberg terminals worldwide, the Taz Profile Scanner is a benchmark technical filtering system that thousands of traders rely on, and now you can too. For a limited time, for TFNS subscribers only, we've reduced the price to just $97. That's over 75% off. Subscribers will also gain access to the December 9th workshop with John Logan. There's no obligation to pay anything. Get your 30-day free trial to the Taz Profile Scanner today by signing up at TFNN.com. The Path of Least Resistance is David White's daily trading newsletter, and if you're looking for active trading ideas, then now's a perfect time for a 30-day free trial to this powerful daily trading advisory service. David uses his years of trading experience to offer his subscribers his trading ideas each morning in his Path of Least Resistance newsletter. Using a combination of equity trades along with options, David keeps his subscribers up to date with all pertinent market information with intraday afternoon updates when warranted. Don't miss out on this great chance to get a 30-day free trial to David's daily newsletter, The Path of Least Resistance, with no obligation to pay anything. David has been delivering solid recommendations for his subscribers recently, and if you'd like to see the type of newsletter he delivers every morning, then visit the front page of TFNN, and you'll find The Path of Least Resistance under Trading Newsletters. For all the details, and to start your 30-day free trial today, log on to TFNN.com now. No matter where you listen to TFNN programming, we want you to know you can always access your favorite shows on demand through TFNN.com. TFNN airs live programming every market day from 8 a.m. till 6 p.m. Eastern, and you can view each program by accessing Tiger TV through our homepage. We even have an easy link for all mobile devices, including iPhones and iPads, located at the top right-hand corner of the TFNN homepage. You can use your smartphone to view Tiger TV, but if you don't have a mobile connection that can keep up with streaming live video, then you can simply visit TFNN.com. MOBI in the browser of your smartphone for live streaming audio of all of our programs. The mission of TFNN is to educate our audience directly and interactively through our interactive website and radio call and talk shows. TFNN is able to teach all levels of investors the technical skills needed to trade in today's marketplace. In order to get the best information possible, TFNN has assembled the most respected financial minds in the country to provide the most current news and comprehensive advice available. TFNN.com. Educating investors. This segment is brought to you by Think or Swim. For more information, just click the Think or Swim banner on the front page of TFNN.com. Welcome back, folks. And uh, folks, buy the euro. This is going to be a wild day out here. The euro is uh, 112. It's going to 113 ASAP. Dollar's going to give it up. Yeah, it's at 448 ticks right now. We're at uh, 94.81. We go over to this euro for a second. I mean, this setup is a trip because, uh, you know, it gets smoked. There's no two ways about that. But what you're what you setting up on the daily and the weekly is a monster hammer. Uh, intraday right now, you're at 112.83, and this little baby just wants to spike. And what you, I suspect what you're going to see before I get off the air right here, I got another uh, 20, uh, 26 minutes, you're going to see the spike just, just lay right into this baby. See, there's nothing to stop this thing. Even Now, what happens with a trade like this goes like this. It can very well just be a counter trend trade. It doesn't have to be a low. I think it is a low, though. The reason I'm saying that is that I think this dollar had the spike high. But guess what? It doesn't matter. This is just a, it, it can be a dead cat bounce. And the way that we had come down yesterday at 320, you know, the euro had gone from 113.56 and went straight down uh, and spiked the low. And when you spike a low or spike a high, that's normally the end of the move, okay, which is really cool. So we'll see where this baby shakes out. If you do trade the Nadex pl pl platform, uh, what you could do... 35, let's go look at this for a second, because if I take a look at this, they got, I'm not going to encourage a five-minute one, that's for sure, but <laughs> what happens, let me just see, I want to see this, U.S. Euro, 
Four minutes and five seconds. Okay, that's pretty cool. So we're at 112.83. How much do we got to give up? Let's see, 112.83. There it is right there. So a buy on that would be one over 112.83. Interesting. So we're, we're right at, oh, this is interesting. Holy, you're not giving up anything. Yeah, so in this context, yeah, the, that's a little bit too much. You'd, you'd want, I'd want something that's out there longer. Um, so if I go into currencies, go into binaries for a second, I go long the U.S. We're at 187. Here it goes right now. 183 above 180. Oh, here's above 186. 183 by one. Yeah. You know, yeah, the the risk versus the reward uh, is not that great right now. But it, it, what you want to do is you'll you'll start understanding the setups. I'll get that call right away. Don't worry. Um, you want to understand these setups because you're going to see the volatilities in the marketplace um, when you have these things set up prior, folks. Okay, um, these are dynamic moves, uh, and your risk is very small compared to your reward. Uh, right now, you, you're going to see this uh, next leg down. The the correlation inside the the dollar, our own S&P, uh, is huge. The bonds, again, are just screaming. The bonds are screaming, folks, okay? This market's going to basically sell off. And I'm telling you, this is going to be, uh, people are going to be scratching their heads to tonight at 4.30. And they're going to be saying, what just happened again? Let's go to uh, Ken in Kansas. Hey, Ken, what's going on? Hi, Tom. Good to talk to you again. You too. How you been, man? Doing good. Very good. Good, good. Uh, I'd like to have you look at SGDM. It's the gold miners. SGDM. So let's take a look at it. This is a, a Sprout Gold Miners ETF. Uh, this was established uh, in uh, 2014. And inside, uh, you know, I like the makeup of this one. This is, uh, this is some strong gold stocks. You have Rangold is 16%, Franco Nevada is 15 Gold Corps 13 Anico Eagles 5 Royals 4 Silver Wheat is four, Barrick is three, Eldorado is 3.9, Tahoe is three, and you got Sabane, 2.8. So, do you own this? You're looking to buy it? What are we doing here? Looking to buy it. Okay, so, um, I'd be, you could buy it right in here. You could buy it right in here, you know. Uh, what I would do, it's down 60 cents right now. It's trading at 20.40. Um, I'd put a stop under like 1962. I wouldn't give it a lot, but this is a decent place to buy it. Uh, How does that compare to SLV? No, well, hold it. You're gonna. Now, this is where what happens is this, folks. Okay, inside the context of understanding technically how things move, um, you're gonna hear something else from me from inside of this. Okay, and it depends on number one, how many cycles you've been through in the marketplace, and looking at all different structures, okay? So this one is unique, and it's unique in the aspect that Sprout, for some reason, well, not for some reason, okay? People like Sprout, okay? Uh, he's a big gold guy. They, you know, that's the bottom line. What has happened, however, okay, is that I can't stand any of his other products. And the reason I can't stand them is that every gold bug in the world that have been holding gold and lost all their money, okay, on a continual basis because they never sell it, um, like buying these. So what ends up happening is this, is that if you're looking at my screen right now, this has a, it, it's a, the premium is a 0 .049, so that's not bad. What will happen, however, inside this product is that as gold goes higher, that premium will go up dramatically, and you'll be advantaged in that, Ken, if you're in it before that happens, okay? Okay. And this is something you want to keep track of in the future, because his other funds, the premium people were paying way too much money for them. The management themselves, okay, were pushing more out because as they push more out at a premium, so picture something. Something that's worth $10, folks, they could push out at 12 because that's what people had put into it. So at certain points, these premiums were 5, 6, 8, 13%. It's like insane, okay? But right now, the way this is set up, because it's a new fund, okay, the premium, there is, there, it's a very slight premium, so... Okay. So what do you think about the finances here? Uh, small banks, like BKCC. BKCC? Uh, uh, 
Uh, BK, B as in boy? Yes. BKCC. Oh, Canadian Bank? Right. Okay, one second. I just got to put a different symbol in there. Okay. No. I'm B not Canadian Bank, but... BK... I, I, I can't seem to pull it up. Oh, there it is. Oh, Black, Black Rock? Oh, there you go. There you go, yeah. Okay, uh, non-diversified closing management fund, middle market companies, wide range of financial solutions... Okay, the company solutions include senior, junior, secured, unsecured, subordinated debt. Okay, so they take in thirty-three million a quarter. No, don't buy this, man. This is this is okay. So this is a high volume low at seven eighty-five, man. That's going to get tested. Okay. Yeah. Okay, looking forward to some recommendations in your gold report. Have a good weekend. Okay, man, you too. Have a great one. Have a safe one. Uh, right. You know, if we go over, and you, you're going to see this this year is a trip, man. Uh, that So the correlation, and you wrap your head around this quick, folks, okay? The correlation, dollar lower, market lower. Euro, it looks like it's bottoming out right now. And this is going to be just it, You know what's going to be really crazy? If, in fact, the first time that... The, our own Treasury Secretary says, yeah, a, a strong dollar is great for America, which we know it is, folks, by the way, okay? But the bottom line, what you also have is this. Do you know the amount of large corporations that I'm sure are screaming, you know, hypocritical? Yeah, they're screaming right now at the Treasury Secretary saying, you got to knock this freaking dollar down, okay? Because we're, gonna, we're taking it and we're taking it to the, you know, clean is in a big way. Let's go to Mike in Dallas. Hey, Mike, what's going on? Hey, Tom, how are you? I'm doing great, Listen, man. You having a good day out there? Having a good day. I did your trade on gold. Yep. The uh, box uh, 1285 to 1300. Okay. And my question was, did you go in, did you try to find the 1285 because the low of gold today is 1284.3? Uh, what happened is this. So here, if you're watching Tiger TV, I'll show it to you, Okay. The, right, the low the, of yesterday, uh, the low of yesterday, not yesterday, where we had the strength, okay, was yeah. at 840 yesterday morning. Yes. That was at 1286.50. Yes. Okay, so my first take was that, okay, that's where it wants to go down to, right? Yeah. So I what I do with all of these Nadex products, folks, is this, is that first I look at the out of time of the trade and say, okay, where do I think it's going to go? So that's where I thought it was going to go, and, you know, it basically got a buck lower, okay? But bottom line, it got down there. Then what I do is I look for the least amount of money that I have to put up for my risk. Because you're always going to make money. It just depends on how much money you lose making it, okay? It, right. it, 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 so that, that's how I come to the 1285. That's how I, that's how I always do this, too, by the way, okay? Um, because what ends up happening, I don't go for the 50-50 deals. You know what I mean? I'm looking for singles, and I'm looking for the bottom of the boxes to put up a lot less money, just in case you do get the, you know, the big swing higher. Correct. Okay. But that's where that came from. Um, it would have been nice, uh, you know, if you get a, get a longer period of time. But 12 o'clock's not bad, you know. Uh, I, I would make sure, you know, you, you basically put a sell in, for the context of, yeah, you know what? Oh, you're going to get it, Mike. So check this out. So the S&Ps are already giving it up, okay? Yeah. What, what we're going to see here, um, there's going to be a dislocation, and, it, and it's happening quickly. And this dislocation uh, is going to shake some boots out here. And, you know, the sell-off is intensifying at this particular point. As yeah. that sell-off intensifies, I expect what you're going to see is... The runs, let me just go over the dollar index for a second. So she, yeah, we're real close here. Okay, so watch what, what has happened with this. And, and the, the, the correlation is really sweet. So the dollar index came down to the first place where, you know, we had some strength. And if you want to see how, just how crazy this is. So yesterday at, at, th at 350, 350 yesterday afternoon, right? Dollar yep. index went from 94.70 to 95. We yep. did that and with 1,300 contracts. Well, we just came down, and we came down with 1,500. Now, you got a little counter trend bounce, but what that tells you is that, guess what? We're going to be back down there again. That's going to build a little cause. Once it's going to, it's going to blow through this 94.49, and we're going to be down somewhere into that 93.30. Go back to the gold contract again for a second. What you're going to see is that on the gold contract, you know, we're at uh, 1289. You're going to see that little baby spike and blow everyone's mind. 
and the, okay. the, the first spike, Mike, okay, don't, I wouldn't expect that it's going to get over the 1294, but it'll get right into it. It'll get right okay. into it. It'll be fast. It'll be furious. And you can expect the rest of this market out here today to be fast and furious, folks. Okay. Well, ha Tom, thank you so much for your analysis. Okay, uh, man. That, that really helps. Okay. Have a Thanks. great one. Have a safe one. You too. And if we go over to the uh, E-minis, folks, okay, that E-mini one, uh, that's turning out really sweet because uh, ESH5... Okay, ESH5 index. Okay, so what we're looking for here is an expansion of volume, of course, as, as you're pushing lower. No, ESH5. Okay, oh, we got it. Hey, check this out. This is going to be a trip. Okay, so... We just broke, uh, we just, uh, we're doing a small ABC down. They're going to blow this market apart. So this, this leg here, we're in, let's see. You get six minutes into, the, into, into it already. We've already done as much volume as we did the last uh, four bars, folks, okay? So your first leg, and this is where you, you always want to understand what is your price projection. And so the price projection in this point is that you, we had a high volume swing low from yesterday. That high volume swing low, 2019. The, the top of that bar, however, and this is where the top of that bar is 2041. So if you're in those trades right now, even if you're in the E-mini, at 2041, that should bounce off that. That's another six points down from where we are. But you can expect um, some bounce off there. What do you do after that point? You see, what is that expansion of volume, number one, on the way back up? You know, uh, what, what, what we do have out here... Um, is not only divergence, okay, but <laughs> you're going to see some action uh, depending uh, how long uh, you've seen bear market moves. These bear market moves, folks, are so cool, it's unbelievable. Um, they're basically frightening when you're in them. There's no two ways about it, meaning if you're, you're shot and it's a counter trend move. Um, the, the, the key is, is that what you're looking for is di divergence in between that. And if we go over to the uh, bond market right now, uh, see, the, the bond market has been the most reliable uh, on a consistent basis as to what it's been doing um, and continues to do. So what we have with the bond market is this. The high of yesterday at 10 o'clock is 150.19. Well, that's going to get tested. Now, the real key is if you're a bull in bonds, which I am, I don't want that to get tested right now. The reason being is that you've had the expansion up, and this has been a heck of an expansion coming off 147.12. That's an insane move. That's a $3,000 move in the bond market, okay? So what you need is this. You, you need to basically, we'll get up another tick or two, and what you'd want to see is you want to see bonds go sideways for about another 30 minutes. Then make, make the run for it, because if they make the run for it right now, it'll be too tired. So we'll, we'll see where the uh, rest of this... Uh, whole baby uh, does shake out. 877-927-6648. We go take a look at, uh, let's go over to Europe for a second. See, this is where the divergence is, too. Uh, the CAT is up uh, 1.8. The DAX is up, uh, no, CAT's 1.6. DAX is up 1.8. Uh, bottom line, folks, S&P's lower, bonds higher, gold higher, dollar lower. Dow right now is down 84, NASDAQ is off 8, S&Ps are off 8.5. We're going to be right back, folks. Has the current market volatility continue to stop you out of trades when the market spikes against you? Now is the perfect time to open up an account with Nadex. Nadex, the North American Derivatives Exchange, is a brand new, completely regulated Chicago-based exchange, and unlike most other exchanges, Nadex allows you to trade directly through them with direct market access when using their completely free trading platform, which also features real-time charts and full customization capability. One of the advantages of trading with Nadex in volatile markets is that your risk is always capped and you have the ability of keeping your trades open even when the market spikes against you. Nadex is completely brand new with a line of unique trading products that are unavailable anywhere else. See how it works at Nadex.com. That's N-A-D-E-X.com.
or click on the Nadex banner on the front page of TFNN.com. Futures and options trading involves risk and may not be appropriate for all investors. Tom O'Brien's weekly gold letter, The Gold Report, gives complete and concise coverage of the entire gold market. Inside, you'll get Tom's commentary on gold, the dollar, the rand, the bond, the XAU, the HUI, and detailed coverage of nearly 25 mining stocks. He'll give you the entry price, price target, and stock price of each stock trade. The Gold Report is a long-term newsletter where the focus is on building real wealth through the management of a successful portfolio of gold stocks. With a lifetime of knowledge and almost 12 years of writing his informative weekly newsletter, The Gold Report, Tom O'Brien can provide you with the important market information to help you make better trades in the gold market. Don't let the next bull run in gold pass you by. To get a month-long free trial to The Gold Report, an $85 value, visit the front page of TFNN.com today. David White's newsletter, The Technology Insider, is focused like a laser on finding the next big things in technology. If you had invested only $10,000 in Microsoft in 1986, you'd have been a millionaire by 2000. Disruptive technology like Microsoft's is the key to these massive long-term profits, and The Tech Insider is the vehicle from TFNN to capitalize on these opportunities. This is the go-to newsletter that identifies, monitors, and profits on mostly little-known cutting-edge companies with great long-term prospects. David's experience is as an inventor of Emmy-winning animation products for TV and Hollywood that propelled a company public. Match that with 14 years as a full-time trader, and he's uniquely qualified to guide you through the light-speed world of ever-evolving high-tech. If you're ready to ride the next big technology bull market for less than $40 per month, log on to TFNN.com and get your two-week free trial to the Technology Insider. Get in on the ground floor of the next big thing today. TFNN is excited about our new software charting program, The Art of Timing the Trade Charts. In collaboration with Tom O'Brien and using his best-selling book, The Art of Timing the Trade, Your Ultimate Trading Mastery System, David White has programmed an outstanding piece of software that will complement any trader's methodology. Using this first-of-its-kind program, The Art of Timing the Trade Charts allows you to scan thousands of stocks for Fibonacci formation setups, including Gartley's, ABC's, Butterflies, and much more. The Art of Timing the Trade Charts Charts is designed to help you when scouring the markets for stocks just beginning to form the trading patterns that many investors spend days, weeks, or even months searching to find. And right now, we're offering licenses available at only $79 a month. We are so confident that you're going to love this new charting software that will even give you a 30-day unconditional money-back guarantee. Don't miss out on this incredible new piece of software. Get your copy of The Art of Timing the Trade Charts today by visiting TFNN.com. Catch Basil Chapman as he uses his Chapman Wave methodology to call the markets. The Tiger Technician's Hour, next on TFNN. Welcome back, folks. Uh, Dow right now is down 42. You get the NASDAQ flat. S&Ps are... Uh, Let's see. Uh, they're down five. If you want to see the direct correlation, folks, okay, this is pretty wild, tick for tick. Uh, inside the dollar versus, you can see, you know, the Dow is down 80. Now we're down 47. The uh, dollar index uh, was basically uh, up uh, well, 500 ticks. Now you're up uh, 684. What do you do? Uh, I want to show you this. You go over to this dollar index, and you're going to see this, this bounce. And it's really wild that how it is just so direct. It is so cool watching this thing shake out. Uh, so the dollar index had gone down this morning from 95.75. You, you're doing the counter trend bounce right now. Let's see. We're at, uh, five minutes into it. Uh, it's coming into the bar with 2,400 contracts, and we'll see whether it can get it. It's got 830 right now. It has another five minutes. But what I expect is it's just a counter trend bounce, you know, after the first leg down. Um, and... The dollar will continue to lower the rest of the day. You'll see the, the correlation inside the market is amazing. Now, it's like, how does, you know, why? I don't know. Uh, bottom line is that this is stuff that you do want to pick up, though, uh, as you're basically trading, or particularly if you're trading on an intraday basis. Um, it's, it's a big number. I remember in the 90s, uh, 
Uh, you know, the bonds never move like they move now. We used to trade specifically off the 30-year bond. And the 30-year bond, folks, it, 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 all this would give you, by the way, okay? It would give you, you know, basically a minute and a half, a minute in, in the 90s, okay? Which, which is a plenty of time. Uh, but that correlation was direct for, oh, for years, okay? Then, of course, that, they all end up blowing apart. They all end up changing. You know, that, that's, that's, uh, that's, that's the bottom line. They absolutely all end up changing. Uh, you want to pay attention to them when they're out here, however. Uh, let's go over to that gold contract for a second. Gold uh, wants some juice underneath this. And you're going to see this thing all over the place today. Um, so here's your first move in gold. And we'll see whether we get any juice behind the move. You got the price spread. We're at uh, 56. And don't forget, folks, if you haven't test drove the Nadex platform yet, great time to do it, okay? Uh, bottom line, go over to uh, our website at TFNN, hit the Nadex banner. They'll, you can open that account ASAP. They'll put $25,000 of paper money into it so you can really start wrapping your head around how these works. And as you're doing it, folks, there's plenty of videos on the Nadex site to understand how these work. Um, pay attention to the tops of the boxes and the bottom of the boxes, whether you're uh, bullish or bearish. That's, that's where you, that's you want to shake this out. Uh, right now, we, the gold contract's going to need a little more juice, that's for sure. Um, but what you have is that it just launched the last four bars. So, and this is where this gets cool. So, see, it's nothing for the gold contract right now to run to 12.92. You know, it's only two more dollars, but that's enough to get basically some excitement going uh, in, inside the gold market. And then all you need is uh, one other operator to come in and whack that baby. Um, and you get a Friday, and there's nothing like a Friday, folks. Uh, for high volatility in the market, particularly high volatility uh, in the, the currencies. Now, watch. <laughs> this is wild, man. I haven't. <laughs> oh, man. I'm telling you. So if we go back over to the dollar index again, you're going to see that. That was it. That was the counter trend bounce. So watch this. She, she just got to uh, 95.07. And they're at, at 03. It's like, hold it. Is that it? Uh, yeah, I do expect that's it. The reason being is that Gold's already moving higher, um, and we'll basically see that uh, baby give it up. You stay right there, folks. I'm man, Mr. Basil Chapman is going to be coming up next with you. Growl and Prowl and Nico and Page going to keep you healthy. I'm man, Dave White's coming back, and then uh, Dave and I will finish off the day. Have a great one. Have a safe one, folks. Thanks for being here. Go get them, folks. Since 1984, Basil Chapman has been using the Chapman Wave methodology to advise traders of his expert market opinion. While originally hand-drawing charts from the late 1970s into the 1980s, Basil noticed that prices under most circumstances virtually always had a certain number of legs to the upside before declining sharply. Later, Basil found that computer software, which included the standard market technical indicators, enhanced the degree of accuracy in calling price turns, as well as market trend calls. Thus was born the Chapman Wave sequence. Using the Chapman Wave methodology along with other indicators, Basil Chapman advises his subscribers of his expert market opinion each market day with his opening call newsletter. Right now, you can get a two-week free trial to the opening call, Basil's daily trading newsletter, by visiting the front page of TFNN.com. Cancel at any time during that trial and pay absolutely nothing. Get your two-week free trial to Basil's newsletter, the opening call, today by visiting TFNN.com. This is TFNN.